So this is the gluten-free blueberry and almond tart. So the first step of the recipe is to make your gluten-free pastry. So here we have gluten-free flour, unsalted butter, sugar, a small amount of xanthan gum and one egg. And we're just going to sieve this with the xanthan gum. Put those in there and we're just going to sieve those together just to combine them. Then we're going to add our sugar and then we add the butter. Butter's chilled butter. That just gets popped in. We just coat each chunk with a bit of flour and the sugar and mix together and we just rub with the tips of your fingers. Just rub to break the fat up and coat the flour. And they have really nice fine breadcrumb pastry. Okay, so next we're going to add the egg to the crumble. And we're just going to stir the egg through to break it up to bring the flour together to a dough. As you can see, it's all coming together now into a nice paste. And once it's mixed enough with a spatula, you can get your hand in there and just bring it together. So here you have beautiful gluten-free pastry. We'll feel slightly wet now, so we're just going to wrap that in some cling film, pop it in the fridge to chill. And here's our chilled pastry. It's absorbed some of that moisture and you've got a really nice pastry to work with. The reason I roll pastry between cling film is so that you don't over flour your pastry, which will then make it crack and difficult to work with. So our pastry is now encased in the cling film. I'm just gonna gently start rolling. And you lift your cling film as you go, just to release the tension. You turn that over. And then on the other side as well. There you go. So we have our pastry ready to line the tin. Just fold it in. And once it's pushed into all into the corners, you can then just roll off your excess. There you go. Ready to be filled. Okay, so we're now going to make our almond filling, ground almonds, also known as almond flour. Caster sugar and butter. And we're now just going to mix this. So I'm just going to start softening the butter. And then to this, I'm going to add an egg. We're just going to mix to bring this together. It will give us a really luxurious almond filling. You can see now this is feeling nice and soft. I'm just going to put a touch of vanilla essence in that for flavour. And you can smell the vanilla now working in there with those flavours. So here we have our tart. We sprinkle the blueberries on the bottom. Okay, so we've added our blueberries. It next goes in our almond filling. There you have the blueberry and almond tart. To finish that, we're gonna make a little crumble. We've got 25 grams of gluten-free flour here. Then there's 10 grams of caster sugar and 10 grams of butter. And we're just gonna rub this together just to make a nice crumble topping. So this will get popped in the oven at 200 degrees C, 400 Fahrenheit, 25 minutes until cooked. So there we have it, our gluten-free blueberry and almond tart. It smells delicious. It just looks lovely and it tastes great. Yeah.